Hi all, welcome to this very honest update regarding YouTube, Twitch and kind of like FIFA 21 in general what is going to be the state of play for it for us because obviously the last few weeks, months well, in all honesty FIFA 20 in general has kind of just been a bit of a letdown from us really because I think a few folk kind of felt oh geez going to do well or whatever and nothing ever really materialises and it's kind of been the way it's been sadly um, for a little while and we really need to have a kind of like a proper sit down, kind of nail down the channel, nail what's going right, what's going wrong and it's, we need to kind of like address it and need to get, like people, like I've pretty much seen 99% of the community do massively better than me um, but it's not even just doing better, it's basically like, if I'm doing like a video, like what am I doing right with it, what am I doing wrong with it, is there something I've missed or is there like something I could improve on, there's like, there's so many like tangible elements that I just either miss out on or just like, there's or there's opportunities that I miss out on, there's like, tons of variables, but it is what it is sadly and it's obviously we've got to kind of get our head down this year, uh, this FIFA hopefully nail down solid uh, career mode like we'll get our fingers out our backside with that because we hope we're going to be doing that with Hibs uh, Mallorca and a couple, maybe a couple other teams never, never materialised there was even ideas I'd pieced together quite early on but I didn't do them because I was just kind of not I was just I just felt like I was playing FIFA 20 for the sake of it and I don't want FIFA 21 to be like that for me this year if it is then I'm kind of like we have to have a right hard think about it but for me, trading SBC stuff, there's, a, there's an SBC idea I wanted, I've not seen at all on the game, um, like anyone do on the game on YouTube, so um, I'm going to try that out, um, hopefully it goes quite well, because it's a, it's, it's a collab based idea, so I'm hoping it can work, so we'll see how that goes, I'm actually quite excited about that if I can pull off, it would be the only reason that I'd actually do an SBC in the first place if I'm honest. Because if I'm brutally honest with the game, I don't really want to do SBCs, I'd rather just trade and I'd rather show you guys how I make my coins, why I make them, and like the effort, kind of like the basically the nuts and bolts of it without putting anyone at the game and showing how like easy it is to actually trade, but also have a bit of patience to do it as well. That's kind of the way I want to look at it with uh, FIFA 21. I just want to trade, I'm not really feeling the motivation to actually play the game, go and play matches, whether it be rival, squad battles, weekend league, objectives, like that's what pretty much FIFA 20 became for me, was just doing objectives, that pretty much became all I was doing, like I could maybe, if it was like Friday, like that weekend, I'd do objectives and then maybe during the rest of the week it was just grind out um, whatever within the game, I don't want to be doing that. If I'm doing SBCs, if it's like a league SBC, I want to be breaking down the team and I want to be breaking down every team in the SBC, kind of like touching the positives and negatives. Um, so if like a, say, Chelsea for example, we'll just say, if you need Jorginho for example in the SBC, if he was to get um, in form for example, or a special card that takes his base card out of packs, who's the alternative that you can look at that kind of reassures the squad that it doesn't inflate it. There's all, I, I really want to kind of nail down the trading and SBC elements better this year, like whereas like on previous years like 17, 18, 19 I was doing that, 20 was just a, like kind of, it felt lazy from me if I'm brutally honest, that's why there was nothing really happening, like people weren't really falling or interested in my Twitter or the YouTube or the Twitch, no matter what I was doing, like I could just be putting up videos for the sake of it, people would be like, eh, eh, it's, like, eh. it's basically what it was like, eh. And that's why I find I don't get comments on the video because it's like people aren't giving feedback to say, oh this is, this is I found this very useful, um, does he play well? Like, that's, like, yes I might not be playing, I might not necessarily play the game, too much for FIFA 21 in terms of actual gameplay, but if the SBC card is, is say 100k, 
like you would say to yourself, right, he costs a hundred k. Here's five alternatives within say that you might do say two cheap alternatives, two mid tier alternatives, and then the two expensive like alternatives. And you say, right, this is so. Th this is six players that can do the same job for this hundred k card. And you maybe say, well, these two that are five k can are probably just as good if if budget's an issue. These two thirty uh, k, um, both very sound. Um, uh, realistically, they'd probably be the two you would look at. And then the two that might be three hundred k, say only buy these two if budget allows. But this guy is the kind of like for a hundred k will do just as good a job as the three hundred k guys. So you've kind of it's how that's where I've got to kind of break it down for FIFA twenty one for like when it comes to like is it worth it? But also breaking down those elements. I've got to kind of do the effort again. That's what I need to kind of do. So if I'm doing those SBC guides, if I'm doing um, trading tips, I've got to kind of nail it all kind of like down and make sure it's actually up to scratch. Like I'm, with the career mode, Hibs were eventually going to actually do. So the aim is to do a, a save where we basically win the league, the Scottish Cup, Europa League and the Champions League. We ain't going to stop until we do all four um, objectives, basically. That's the aim. Um, speaking to a couple of mates that are um, sorting me out with um, graphics to kind of sort within the save. So like when I'm doing um, different elements, it's to kind of up the, like the, the performance and production scale of it. Like yes, the menu within the games are sound, but I'd quite like to add my own elements within, so that way it kind of like just ups the um, scale a little bit and shows a bit more emphasis. I've been, cause I've been getting all that kind of, I've been preparing like the thumbnail stuff on my end, um, so I've got that all kind of sorted out, relatively happy, and I just kind of need the game itself now and just kind of detail the team um, for like what's the f initial improvements to put in for like the first season, and then obviously. When it comes to like second season onwards, like where do we kind of improve from there? So this FIFA, I'm not wanting to use it as an excuse to say right, let's get it done. And the aim I'm thinking at the moment is every month, um, is an episode. So if it's like a 25 30 minute video, uh, fair enough. And it's like say the games in that month, so maybe pre season dictates the first episode though. Um, but then from there, I'll just make sure it's. Like seconds, like every month it'll be like August, September, and so forth. That way, we're getting through the episodes, but also we're not kind of like dilly dallying with elements as well. But I really want to kind of nail down everything. Like streaming wise, I want to be streaming more often, whether it be the trading stuff, and um, kind of just showing tips. I might do that in the evening, but as it's, the aim would be like an 8 a.m. and a 4 p.m. upload. That's the kind of times I'm looking at. So that's why I'm hoping maybe in the evenings, the stream in the evening, um, most likely on Twitch, I uh, might be able to stream, do the odd YouTube stream, I'm not sure, but YouTube, I've noticed, doesn't always seem to like my computer, so, or my setup anyway, for whatever strange reason, and I prefer, I, I find Twitch just as good anyway, and I can just put the highlights on uh, YouTube if necessary, but train tips will keep them going, um, and as I say, we'll get the SBC stuff. That's going to be our main focus still anyway. Uh, collabs, I want to obviously kind of work on my own stuff. So like the SBC based stuff that I've got in mind, I'd quite like to do. Even the trading elements, I'd quite like to kind of... But that's kind of what this, this SBC idea that I've got in mind that touches on trading, touches on SBC stuff. And it can definitely bring in a lot of different people. It's not going to be just one console. This can be an idea that can be done on... Anyone that plays on PC, anyone that plays on Xbox, PlayStation, it can utilise all the consoles, and it can not just be one v one. I can, I think the most I can put it to is four realistically. But um, it's an idea I am quite excited about actually. If it if it goes well, but that's what I want to do is try and engage, get back to engaging with the community, seeing like how folk are doing, posting away like tweets and. Um, comments and videos, seeing how people are doing. I need to get back into that. I felt like the last FIFA, I wasn't doing that as much, and 
we need to address it. We badly need to address it. That's kind of why, like, the numbers are free are free falling. It comes down to me. If I don't get my finger out my backside, then people aren't going to be interested. So hopefully we get involved with the community and a bit more again. And hopefully the content production improves hopefully tenfold as well. But well, it's going to take obviously a bit to get used to again, but it's definitely a challenge I've got to kind of get up to because obviously this year's been in general a struggle for a lot of us and a lot of people have obviously adapted to it better than some and some haven't adapted it to it very well so I'll get my finger out the backside hopefully as I said I'll hopefully get the structure and the format and the routine back into the format and we definitely have a lot of fun with what we do but I'm planning to get our teeth into hopefully every day content wise as I say if it's two videos it may go to three but we'll see how it goes from there but let me know folks in the comments down below what your thoughts are for FIFA 21 and how you feel about the channel ahead smash like so always sub to the channel if you're new and I'll catch it all